Yes, he's still at that elite level. Are you kidding me? Are you joking? Of course he is. And it's the quality of the goals. It's the drive. It's the, it's the personality. It's the moment. It's a guy who has an understanding of what he means to his team, whether it's club or country. And the fact that when Cristiano Ronaldo is playing, we're paying attention. Mm. We're paying attention. He still, even at 35 years old, when he has the ball at his feet, if you're sitting back, you kind of sit up a little bit and you pay attention because it is indeed Cristiano Ronaldo. And the truth of the matter is, for him and what his future looks like, because you just mentioned big picture, what his future looks like for Portugal, it looks great. Mm. Because look at the players that he has around him. Look at the talent. It's Bruno Fernandes, it's Joe Felix, Andres Silva, Bernardo Silva, and there's talent everywhere. Everywhere you turn right now for Portugal in the attacking half, there is talent. And so it doesn't have to be all about Ronaldo. It doesn't have to be him creating for himself and scoring the goals himself. No, he can be what he is right now at this stage of his career, the guy who inside the 18-yard box can do spectacular things. And even if it's not inside the 18-yard box, he still showed us that he still has something special to offer everybody, including those of you, including you, <laughs> who do not believe. He's still elite, and he is very much in that messy, Ronaldo, and then everybody else conversation. Uh, Stevie, when we talk about Ronaldo, and we've talked about him a lot on this show recently, uh, there's words that we hear a lot of, right? Hunger uh, and desire. But Stevie, those are cliches. I would assume every player is hungry and has the desire to score goals. Why is it that Ronaldo's hunger ends up in this mountain of goals? Well, a word you've just used two or three times here, it's called goals. Um, that's, that's what the game's all about. Uh, that's what we all want to do. As we, as kids growing up, the only thing you want to be is the guy scoring the goals, the guy putting the ball in the net. But you know that as as you progress and get older and, and then you get into the professional ranks, all of a sudden, scoring goals isn't quite as easy as it was when you were a kid. And the fact that this guy is still scoring goals the way he did when he was a kid, at 35 years of age, against the best defenders in the world, tells you this guy is absolutely elite and 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 he's still doing what what's wanted of him from his clubs you know he went to Juventus to win the Champions League well again this year it didn't work out but he did his job it was the rest of them that didn't do their job and then you ask the question to Ali about is he still up there well you know one too long ago we we're talking about this incredible leap with an incredible header what a goal and now we're talking about him getting over 100 international goals. So he's, he's absolutely still on the edge of everybody's tongue. He's still producing. We're still talking about him. And he's still fantastic. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+.